If you're craving cheesecake, but maybe not all the calories that come with it, you're in luck. In today's Healthy Living, sponsored by InReach Physical Therapy, we welcome food and fitness expert Jenna Bernhardt. Jenna, always a pleasure to have you in the yes. studio. Thank you for having me. Jenna, we love it when you're here because you always bring us treats. Yes, <laughs> yes. I love treats. I love snacks, so why not share? <laughs> well, and we were talking yesterday about cheesecake, and Natalie was saying that's the one that she doesn't really like as much, and I'm like, give me all the cheesecake. Yes. I what? can't say no to cheesecake. I love cheesecake. Why did you say <laughs> that yesterday? You don't like lemon bars. Lemon. And I'm like, no I'm, lemon today. The There's lemon. no lemon. Okay. All cheesecake. <laughs> but we we do have kind of a, a breakdown of a kind of cheesecake that might you know fulfill that craving. So first of all, let's talk about the recipes. Yes. How do you come up with these? You know, where do you get them from? So I'm a sweet tooth. I love desserts. I love. Um, just trying new things, but we all know that if you do have health and fitness goals, you can't always have the higher calorie options. You can sometimes, not always. So how can we have the best of both worlds, right? So I like to take these recipes and make them less calories, but still delicious. Mm -hmm. Who wants to eat boring chicken and broccoli all day long while trying to get to your goals, right? Right. Well, speaking of delicious, I mean, what yeah. you see here on the table looks pretty delicious. So yeah. let's talk about the recipe that you brought to share. No bake protein blueberry cheesecake? Or you can do blueberry. Today I did strawberry. strawberry. But gotcha. we do have a blueberry recipe. You just swap out the fruit. Perfect. So yeah, let's whether do you prefer it. blueberry or strawberries. Peach, you can do ma mandarin, Peach. oranges, whatever you want. I would choose strawberries. I would choose. So that's why I'm oh. glad you brought that, if yes. I'm being honest. But okay, walk us through okay. it. How easy is this? I can't cook. Yes. This looks like my kind of meal to put together. So the key is the Greek yogurt should have protein in it. This one has 25 grams, but you can find other ones that have 10 grams, 15 grams, whatever you like. Make sure it's Greek yogurt with protein in it. That's the kicker. That's the protein in the recipe. So we're going to start with the graham cracker crust. You can put maybe half of this inside a glass. Oh, I love it. Which also you can use uh, mason jars, screw on the lid, and take it to work. Oh, that's yeah. such a cute I idea. I said half. Such a <laughs> half the jar. Half See, of I it. I told you. Half. I was like, are you sure you want Natalie to be doing this? She, she doesn't always listen. <laughs> then take some of the pudding mix. Now this is sugar-free pudding powder mix, and you put it inside the yogurt. Some. Oh, inside Some. the yogurt. Yep. Like, Tablespoon okay. is perfect. That's great. Okay, and you stir it. Well, Natalie. Okay. And then you stir it together. <laughs> and that's the cheesecake base. Now, you can stick it in the refrigerator for a while if you want to harden up. I don't. I make it. I prepare it. And then I stick the whole thing in the fridge till I'm ready. Oh my okay. Gosh. And this is sugar-free, fat-free cheesecake. Cheesecake. You could use chocolate flavored. Yeah. You could use pistachio. Yeah. Whatever you want. Whatever you have. I didn't even know Jello came up with stuff it's, like this. It's pretty awesome. And you take half of the yogurt <laughs> and you put it inside on top of the graham crackers. Notice how she emphasized <laughs> half, guys. Well, re remember, uh, she said half now. Okay, there we go. Perfect. Good and job, you could Natalie. always make it as pretty as you want, um, spread around whatever, but that looks great. And then you do half of the strawberries. Half. <laughs> so my kiddos love helping me with this. Yes. It's so easy. You you can just have them do sprinkles on top, chocolate mm -hmm. chips, peanut butter drizzles, and then you start over back with the graham crackers. Oh my gosh, this is so now much fun. Now we get it. It's yeah. like two layers, and get we it? would call this a parfait. A parfait. Okay. Parfait. And then the rest of the Greek yogurt, all of that can be in there. Oh. There's flavors of Greek yogurt, yogurt like um, key lime pie. Mm -hmm. They have all sorts out there. So have fun, do whatever you want. Okay, and then I was just curious. Um, you said you have a sweet tooth. Yes. So when you have something like this, how many how many calories are you consuming, and are you watching the sugar amount? It's as well? almost always protein and calories that I watch. Carbs and fats can kind of fall wherever they want. You can still see great progress. Sugar is good to watch as well, um, but this is very low sugar. Fruit, <laughs> there's fruit, the sugar-free pudding mix, and then in the yogurt, and very low calorie. It's probably about 250 calories for the whole cheesecake parfait, where right. one slice of cheesecake can be a thousand calories. Right. That's Ooh. a huge See, chunk. that's insane. I mean, yes. and that's why, yeah, like I said, it's hard for me to turn that down yeah. too. But this is a way to, you know, quench that craving. And then how many calories were you saying? 250 to 300, wow. depending on the fruit you use or the yogurt you use. Okay. Look how beautiful that is. <laughs> Good job. I mean, I, I'm not going to say Jenna's is more beautiful than she did beforehand, but let, we should probably get a little just quick side oh by side God. here. But that took, what, 30 seconds to make? Yeah. I mean, I can't wait to eat it. Yeah, kids yeah. can eat it. You can put it in your lunch bag or whatever. It's a bedtime snack. 
Perfect. Love it. Jenna, you know, coming up with healthy alternative alternatives is not your only specialty. Yes. You're a fitness expert. So I want to know, where can we find your workouts? Because I hear some of them are free. They are. So on my Instagram, it's Jenna Bernhardt 10 And that's where you can find my, I'm posting things all the time. Kids workouts, workouts with babies. I have my free recipes. <laughs> and then once you sign up for my coaching, you get a recipe book. And then you get my coaching and then you get all of the workouts. Oh so gosh. Instagram's like a sneak peek. My coaching is everything. Well, and I just love that, you know, you put out some free content out there for people and you get to showcase like exactly what you do yeah so just like you're doing today and they're really fun videos and I have to say as a mom of littles like Jenna gets it like she comes up with ways to do a workout in the park while your kids are playing stuff like that so such right. great ideas yes, always thanks. thank you so much for bringing this in today yes of course thank you all right, and this has been our Healthy Living, which is sponsored by InReach Physical Therapy. If you'd like to reach out to Jenna directly for packages or pricing, her website is foodandfitness.online. Check it out. All right.